Time to sleep, Doctor. Four years lost in limbo. Not at all. Your body will be stimulated by machines and I will provide the impulses to activate your brain. Sorry, lost in dreams then. The goal of the simulation is to put you in an optimal state of mind for your mission by activating your cognitive and emotive circuits. Nim, my mind is the reason I'm on this mission. Spending this cryosleep time on my research would bring us so much closer to a solution. You will have the opportunity to work later, but there are other matters you need to tackle first. Go to sleep now. This is amazing. Finally on Primus Vita. Nim, the pictures you showed me did not do it justice. Thank you, Austin. I'm glad you believe that. Right. We're not there yet. I get it. Quick as usual, Dr. Blair. All right. Focus, Austin. This is all happening in your mind. What is this place anyway? According to my estimate, 46.7% of your time will be spent outside of your lab. And the goal of this simulation is to prepare you for every possible situation. Let's hope you use more of my brain later. Don't worry. All areas of your brain will be called upon. I monitor everything. In fact, your ability for humor is worryingly low. How do I open this door?
Damn it, Nim. Yes, I'm here to fight the Shatters, but not literally. I'm a scientist, Nim. I have no field training. What's this? Okay, but we have nothing to defend ourselves against the Shatters. I have to figure something out. Seriously, Nim? Anybody could do the job, but you send me my brother. Uh, Nim, I don't want to relive that memory. It's in the past. It's over. In this memory, like all the others I'm preparing for you, there's something you can learn. Find the key items and make sense of what happened. This is a waste of time. Kobe was angry. I know why. There. Done. Thank you. But how are you feeling, then? Pissed off, of course. Who likes to be yelled at? Drinking, losing control, and smoking cigars. None of these even remotely interest me, so it's no wonder I didn't show up. Plus, risking starting a fire? Utterly irresponsible.
He was annoyed that I didn't go to his crew party. The thing is, I saw no reason to celebrate our imminent deaths. You mean you saw no reason to be part of a team that could save your life on the upcoming mission? No reason to go to a party that your own brother personally invited you to. And you never took the time to let me know you weren't coming. Here we go again. As if there weren't more important things to do than getting drunk and trashing your place. Maybe he reacted like that because of his leg. I arrived at a bad time. Sorry, Kobe, I, I didn't want to trouble you. Stop right there, Austin. I'm way more than your physically altered little brother. Stop protecting me and accept that I'm a lieutenant. I know you're a grown-up. It's okay. I just don't want to make you feel ashamed or anything. Ashamed? Ashamed? You really don't get it. 